Hello everyone, and this is Eddie Reyes with Jurex Bar Prep. And by the time you view this video, the exam results for October 2020 will already have been released to the examinees. Most examinees will know already if they passed or if they did not pass. So for those of you who passed, congratulations. And for those who did not pass, do not despair. I'm gonna give you some tips on how to maximize for these six weeks we're gonna have six full weeks to study until the february 2021 bar exam is administered uh, quick story about a time when i went snowboarding for the first time long story short i asked my friends hey should i hire an instructor they said no you you don't really need to so i did not and what ended up happening i ended up just Landing on my face several times, they called me Snow Bunny. Right, I did not know how to snowboard, and these weren't bad people. They they were actually they are actually good friends. I I just saw them like we had a reunion. That was 14 years ago. So, right, these are good people. But right, but when it comes to learning something, a skill like snowboarding, it helps to have the guidance of an instructor, of a coach. And the reason I mention that is because of this, of these six weeks that we have. If you did not pass the California bar exam, you have to maximize. And I am going to offer my services and my coaching services. And a lot of people say, hey, you know, a lot of people say, hey, look, what I'm going to do this time, I'm going to hire a bar, uh, a bar tutor. And what does the bar, bar tutor do? They, they will grade the, the examinee's essay, right? Provide good feedback. Am I a fan of the feedback and the grade? The answer is no. Why? Because the way you learn faster, more efficiently is the practical application. And that's what I provide. Just like snowboarding. The second part to that is that I did take a snowboarding. I've been snowboarding for the last two years. And this time I did hire a coach and they helped me. And that's how I was able to over overcome my yeah, I guess I, I had some kind of, um, I, I didn't view snowboarding too favorably because of a bad, of a bad past experience. But now, right with with guidance, I'm, I'm able to snowboard with confidence. Am I elegant at it? No, but I'm still learning. In fact, the last time I took a snowboard trip, I also hired a coach, and I'm improving as I go along. But luckily, I don't have a timeline, right? Like the examinees do. So, what the point of that is that we are going to apply practical application. Now, what? How am I going to help you? I'm gonna. You're gonna send me an essay. I'm gonna grade it, provide feedback. But we're also gonna confer. We're gonna meet live, right through Google Docs. We're both gonna be looking at the same document. We're gonna be on Zoom. We could be right viewing each other if that's what you prefer. Most people do. And we're going to convert your essay, which is a non-passing score. We're going to turn it, we're going to convert it into a, until it receives, right, the, until it has the qualities of a passing score. I am going to leave more information here at the bottom. So I wish everyone the best. Again, for those who passed, congratulations. And if you did not pass, I've been there. And let's work together and let's, let's get your name to appear on the pass list. Wish everyone the, all the best until soon.